Hello from Better Bee. Once again, it's time to kill those Varroa mites. We chose to use Apolife Var today, so we need to remove this super. To use some miticides, no honey supers can be on. Apolife Var is one of those miticides. Remember, the word super means any box of honey meant to be consumed by humans. The essential oils in Apolife Var will leave residues in honey. Though this is an organic treatment, nobody wants those residues. Yuck. Once the treatment is all finished, you can immediately put your supers on, but don't harvest until at least a month after adding those supers. Some miticides have temperature restrictions, and with Apolife Var, the daytime high temperatures must be between 64 and 95 degrees Fahrenheit. We put a triangle of skateboard under this super yesterday. So the super is bee-free today and ready to take in the house. This brood chamber is made of two deep boxes. The dose for a colony in one deep or two deeps is the same, and that dose is one wafer. Three packets is what you need for the complete treatment of two hives. The instructions on how to use it are on the back of the label. Peel apart the two layers of the label and lift up to read all instructions and precautions. The warnings on the label say wear gloves and safety glasses plus a particulate mask. You don't want any of this on your mouth or skin or in your eyes. Apolife Var is fragile, so take care when you handle these packets. But don't worry if the wafers are broken. We'll show you later in the video what to do if they are. Let's take one wafer and cut it into four pieces. You could break it into four instead of cutting. Treatment should be started in the coolest part of the day. Morning or evening is best. Set each of the four small pieces on the top bars outside the limits of the brood nest, not directly above brood. The active ingredients will steadily become a vapor that sinks through the hive over the next week. So it must be applied at the top of the brood boxes, never between brood boxes. Our temperatures are in the high 80s and low 90s this week, so we're leaving the entrance of this solid bottom board wide open. If the temperatures were at the lower part of the range, like in the 60s, we would reduce the entrance. On any hive with a screened bottom board, insert its tray and close the slot at the back. Remember I said I'd explain what to do if your Apolife var was broken or crumbled when you opened the packet? Don't worry, it's still usable. One colony's dose is one wafer, and there are two wafers in a full packet. So take the amount that equates to one wafer, half a packet. Divide that into four piles and put them on the top bars. Now we're back, 10 days later. Besides the vapors which evaporate when Apolife var is opened and set in the warm environment of the colony, the bees also tear little bits off of the edges. In this colony, two pieces have been totally evaporated or chewed away, and two partly remain. This time Greg is breaking the wafer instead of cutting it in four. This second application of all pieces of one wafer goes on and then in 10 more days the third and final application will go on. Apolife var is a good choice when temperatures are right and no supers are on. It's an organic mite treatment and takes three to four weeks to finish the whole treatment. Write to us at Better Bee if you have any questions.